All right. Hey, Joe, thanks for posting this question. So you wrote that you felt you did well at the listing presentation, but you walked out without paperwork and they said they were interviewing other agents. So what do you do? Here's the thing. When my agents used to tell me that they felt like they did well, but there was no signed paperwork, then I automatically know that they were probably talking too much. So I would maybe revamp your presentation and see or relook at it and see if you were talking too much. But you should also know before you head out there, what is their plan? Are they planning on interviewing other agents? There's a lot of pre-listing questions that you can ask them and you should ask them before you head out. If you need a list of these questions, you can go to jennifermertland.com slash vault or DM me and I'm happy to send them to you. And one of those questions is, do you plan on interviewing other agents? Or whatever, right? And so like, you need to know that before you go in. Do you plan on listing the home yourself? Do you plan on renting it? Like you want to know what their plan is before you get there. Okay. The purpose of the listing appointment is to get the listing. So that is your goal. Once you get there, if they still could say, Hey, we plan on, you know, talking to the other agents or whatever. Okay. That's fine. Here's the thing. I would say at this point in my presentation, typically people sign with me. I find that if they don't, it's only one of three things. The first could be the price. Are we in alignment on the price that we think the market can get for the home? And they'll tell you, right? The second is the commission. Does the commission seem fair to you? The third is the marketing plan. So you're pulling out the objections, but honestly, these are usually only the three objections that they have. If it's the marketing plan or if it's like seems like they're not really giving you something, they probably just don't like you or don't feel connected to you and that's okay. You could just move on. Now, if they still are these type of people that have to, they have to interview the, the people that they said they would, you can say something like, cause they like already promised them or whatever, right? You can say something like, you know, I completely understand, but here's the thing do you feel that I can sell your home? And they say, yes, right? Or let's assume they say yes. And they say, these, these other agents are taking time away from their family to come and meet with you. And you and I both know that, that I'm the best fit for you and I, we can get this home sold. So here's what we can do to help, to help you keep your word or however you want to put it, right? Here's what we'll do. We'll go ahead and sign the paperwork now then I'll call those agents so that they have the first right and can get their buyers in first so that they can still get paid. And don't worry, like this happens all the time. And then that makes them feel more comfortable. You're calling them, blah, 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 blah. Now, if that still doesn't work, then set, ask them, okay, when is the last, um, the last appointment? And let's say it's, you know, Tuesday at four. Say, great. Why don't we meet? Um, why don't I come back at Tuesday at five? And that way we can answer any we can answer any questions that maybe those agents brought up um, that we didn't talk about. Because I find that a lot of people will say different things or whatever, make some other points that we didn't talk about, and that way we can fully wrap it up. And I trust that because you're keeping those appointments, you will also keep this one as well. Does that seem fair? And they'll be like, yes. So try some of those. Now that you've already left, if you've already left and you haven't done that, I would go ahead and call them back and say, I was really thinking about, um, I was really thinking about what we discussed and I just had a couple of follow up questions and then do, do the, th the three things, the price you set for the home, the commission and the marketing plan and see if you can get anywhere and see if you can get back in there and get back in front of them. All right, call me with questions at uh, 513 400 one six nine one. Good luck.